Damn. I have no one to work here right now. Some small businesses are scrambling to figure out how to stay afloat after a ruling by the high court. A recent state Supreme Court decision is changing the way independent contractors are classified, and it's already having a big impact on local shops. CBS 13's Angela Greenwood is live with more on why some fear the ruling could shut down businesses, Angela. Yeah, Tony and Adrian, this is one business that's already feeling the impacts. Bottle and Barlow, where barbers have actually quit following this ruling. It's a ruling that many fear will hurt millions of workers and also affect businesses' bottom lines. The work doesn't stop at downtown Sacramento's Bottles and Barlow. I mean, I'm still here cutting hair. You know, we're very much open. Even if overnight it became a one man shop. I lost my entire staff. Owner Anthony Giannotti says all seven of his barbers quit after a state Supreme Court ruling that will change the way they're employed. Well, it doesn't just affect my business, it affects every independent contractor in the state of California. Historically, the cosmetology industry, barbers and hairstylists have been classified as independent contractors. Contractors, but the ruling now says cannot classify someone as an independent contractor if they offer the same service that is the primary business of the business. So basically, a barber can no longer work in a barber shop as an independent contractor where they set their own hours and pay. Instead, they'll now have to become employees of the business on an official payroll. Which is insane for a small business like this like we can't afford to have a bunch of employees what are you going to pay them you know minimum wage Christina Rodriguez and her husband own Victory Inc in West Sacramento an industry full of independent contractors she worries these new rules will put shops out of business they will disappear it's not going to be um, sustainable for them anymore I mean this goes as far as your FedEx drivers are independent contractors your personal trainer um, yoga instructors, Pilates instructors. This is going to have a huge effect on the fifth largest economy in the world. Now, Giannotti will be holding a seminar here next Sunday, which will be open to all independent contractors. There will be attorneys as well as employment experts on hand to answer any questions. Yeah, clearly some far-reaching impacts here. All right, Angela, thanks so much for that live report.